Merchandising the iPad Retina. Place the iPad Retina face down on a padded surface. Use an alcohol pad to fully clean the back of the device, making sure to remove any other stickers or film. Be sure to also clean the sides of the device. Adhesive will be used on the brackets, and the sides must be clean. Use any clean cloth to wipe off the excess alcohol. To merchandise the iPad Retina, you will need the puck, the iPad Retina brackets, security screws, and the MTI Red Security Screwdriver. Take the puck and one of the brackets and align the bottom of the bracket with the bottom of the puck. Take the MTI Red Security Screwdriver and a security screw and screw the bracket into place. Next, remove the adhesive pad covering from the side of the bracket. Then, remove the adhesive pad covering from the puck. Using the bracket, line up the puck so that it is right below the Apple logo on the iPad. Make sure that the puck is oriented so that the charging cable port is on the same side as the iPad charging port. Press the puck down firmly. Next, remove the adhesive covering from the other bracket. Line up the bracket so it is straight on the iPad. Take the MTI red security screwdriver and a security screw and attach the bracket to the other side of the puck. Next, remove the protective covering from both sides of the brackets. Allow at least one hour before putting the device on display to allow the adhesive time to cure. Take the carbon tether. If it is tied in a loop, make sure to remove the loop. Remove the dust cap from the carbon tether. Tighten the carbon tether screw to the puck by hand. And then further tighten with the black puck tool handle. Snap the dust cap back onto the carbon tether screw and lower the iPad into the riser. Insert the IntelliKey into the ISM and remove it to arm the system. When the system is armed, the puck light will be glowing solid red. Next, take the product-specific charging cable, plug the mini USB port into the puck, and plug the lightning cable end into the iPad. The iPad Retina is now merchandised. Demerchandising the iPad Retina. Begin by inserting the IntelliKey into the ISM to keep the system from alarming. Remove the charging cable from the puck and from the iPad. Take the black puck tool handle, remove the dust cap, and begin to unscrew the puck from the iPad.
Then remove the carbon tether screw by hand. Tie the carbon tether cable into a loop so that it does not fall down through the riser. Take the MTI red security screwdriver and remove the security screws from both of the brackets. Gently remove the brackets from both sides of the puck. Take the black puck tool and, using the wide end, gently twist the puck back and forth to remove it. Make sure to remove any leftover adhesive from the iPad and remove any excess VHB adhesive from the puck by rolling your thumb over the adhesive. Do not use any sharp objects to remove the adhesive from the puck or the device. Next, we will apply a fresh VHB pad to the puck. Use an alcohol pad to clean the surface of the puck. Make sure to remove all residue from the puck. Use any clean cloth to wipe off the excess alcohol. Take a fresh VHB pad, peel off the sticker, line up the bottom of the VHB pad with the bottom of the puck, and carefully adhere the VHB to the puck. Once the VHB pad is in place, press down firmly to ensure a proper bond with the puck. Thank you for viewing this video. We hope it will help your team.